buzzing about the rising empire of team capital. I'll answer your question with another. How much do you know about the great Julius Caesar? Over 2,000 years ago on a day not much different than this one, the great Caesar stood at the edge of the Rubicon River. With his soldiers behind him, he had two choices. Cross the river, do battle against Goliath, risk all for the crown, or retreat, let up, settle, submit to oppression. Caesar meditated for a moment, then, thrusting his fist into the blue sky, he bellowed, the die is cast, as he marched his ambitious soldiers on to Rome. For Caesar, there was no waiting for destiny to materialize. That's why Jason Capital studies Caesar, just like he studies so many of history's greatest men. Many today want to know, what is the rising empire of Team Capital all about? Well, you could read about the almost 200,000 men in 125 countries who've already been saved from the vice grip of comfort and mediocrity, the society that wants its men shackled and neutered. Or you could discover the 12,000 success stories of Team Capital men who were once alone, unconfident, even rejected, but now date all the women they desire and deserve. Hell, you could even read about the men who walked into the Team Capital world broke and strutted out millionaires. But not here, not today. Because Team Capital isn't about just girls, money, or toys. It's about men. Men reclaiming their power, their status, their freedom. This is the rising empire. This is Team Capital. Oh.